Recommendations is the fastest way that creators are building their newsletters on Kit right now. And what we've seen is that creators who are using recommendations are growing twice as fast as creators who aren't. So there's a lot of new features and a lot of new ways that you can discover creators in order to partner. And I want to give you a little behind the scenes look of how I use it and some of the features you might not know exist. So first, when you come in, you've got the discover page and you can just see all these great creators on the platform that you might want to connect with. So Amanda and Sam are both speaking at Craft and Commerce this year. And then there's also uh, popular authors like Robert Greene. So you can dive in, all kinds of great people in here. I wanna show you a few different things that you might not have seen yet to help you find more creators. So as you scroll down, there's a few different lists of creators who are suggested for you. The first one is creators with content similar to yours. What it's doing is it's analyzing all of the content that you've sent and then the broadcast and content sent by other creators and say, hey, here's similar or complimentary content that might be interesting. You can go through and see, oh, there's Justin Welsh. We both talk about entrepreneurship and building businesses. So I can click into him and maybe make a recommendation there. Or if it's not a fit, I could say not interested and they won't show up anymore. The next one is shared connections. So these are people who are being recommended by or recommending other people that are in my network. So I'm going to find people talking about similar things to what I usually talk about. Again, I can flip through or say not interested if it's not a good fit. The next two that I want to show you are my favorites, and that's creators that you subscribe to and then creators that subscribe to you. So if I flip through this, it's already a list of creators that I subscribe to their newsletters and enjoy. So whether it's Kay and Leo, Louie, James Clear, et cetera, I can flip through this and see the creators that I've already been reading. And that makes it really easy to recommend them. But the next one is even more interesting. The creators who subscribe to you. So as I'm looking through this list, and I'm trying to see who do I want to partner with? Well, these are already the creators who are on my list, who are reading me on a regular basis. And so if I find one that could be a good fit, well, I can just click on them and hit recommend. Now, I might also want to reach out and connect on social media to say, hey, why don't we both recommend each other? Or why don't we partner up in some way? The great thing about this is you can get insights about what other creators follow your content just by joining Creator Network and importing your audience. I can immediately see these are the creators that subscribe to me, that follow me, and they could be a great fit for partnerships. Another thing that you might notice is these little circles around the profile. And that tells you two things, whether they're a consistent creator or not, and whether they're growing fast. So consistent creator means they've been writing and putting out content consistently, and that's going to have them show up higher in each of these rankings. And then growing fast means that within the band of audience size, they're in that top 10% of creators. So as you're looking through for people to partner with, you can be confident that these are active creators who are growing quickly. And again, with all of these, if there's a creator in a list that's not a good fit, maybe you're a fan of their content, but you talk about two totally different things, you can just come over here and click not interested and they won't show up anymore. So you can keep this list curated and Kit will keep bringing you new recommendations of creators that you should connect with. You can also search by creator name, topic, or keyword. You can browse by creator type. You can browse by topic. And now you can even browse by language. So if you're writing in another language besides English, you can now find creators who are talking to their audience in the same language and they'll be a great fit for you to connect with. And of course, you can combine these filters. So let's say that we want to find food bloggers who are writing in French. We can narrow down based on both of those options and get to a focused list. And there we go. You can also browse this whole network. So if you find a creator who looks interesting, click on them, it opens up their profile. But then you can also see who they're recommending and who's recommending them. So if I click in right here, then I might see, oh, they're being recommended by all these great creators. Oh, there's Charlie, our creative director here at Kit. Let me click into her, her profile. We can see that we're both already recommending each other, but I can keep browsing from there. If I'm looking for other great designers, I might look through the 71 people who are already recommending Charlie. I can click into that, find someone else. There's me, of course. Here's Joe from Teleprompter Pro, and I can see his profile and go in from there. At any time, if I want to reach out, I've got all the social networks listed there. I can click in, go to Instagram or any other place. So... Browse this network, explore, find interesting people, see who someone's recommending, and you can just discover and go so many places from there. The final thing I want to talk about is smart recommendations. 
Kit has 60,000 creators who are paying for the platform and are growing serious businesses. But there's way more. There's hundreds of thousands of free users who are getting started and growing early on. Now, what Kit does is when one of those free users is using Creator Network, it reserves some slots for smart recommendations. And what this means is that we use that in order to drive awareness for all the creators on paid plans. This means that just by signing up for Kit and being a paying customer, you get awareness from people in your niche who are going to be a good fit for your newsletter. Because of the quality of the network, recommendations grows your email list with high quality subscribers running in the background. And you can use this amazing creator discovery platform to go and meet new creators, form partnerships, whether it's for recommendations, for a mastermind, uh, content swap, or pretty much anything else. The creators who I've connected with have been absolutely instrumental in growing my business. So I'd really recommend that you get in here, browse the network, find some creators who seem interesting, reach out, build a friendship, build a relationship, and grow your businesses together.